Hi everyone, I'm Rob and welcome to another episode of Beyond Beginners. So as you know, this is a series of Rubik's Cube videos for people who just learned to solve using the beginner's method. I show you extra algorithms that help you be a little bit more efficient in your solve. This isn't about speed cubing. If you want to do that, there's millions of other videos online. Today, I'm going to return to discussing the middle layer and the particular case where you have to swap two pieces that are diagonally opposite each other on the cube. Okay, so when we're solving the middle layer, you sometimes get a situation where a piece needs to go in the diagonally opposite place from where it's sitting. So for example, here, this piece needs to go all the way around there, and this piece needs to go all the way back there. These two pieces need to be swapped. Now, the beginner's method will ask you to move this place piece out of place. It will ask you to move this piece out of place, then do some turning around on the top, and then finally put things back into place. Um, but that's very inefficient, and curing inefficiency is the purpose of these Beyond Beginner videos. So I'm going to show you an algorithm for just swapping those two pieces straight away. That's the algorithm. And of course, you know that means a half turn on the front, a clockwise turn on the top, and a clockwise turn on the bottom, then a half turn on the right hand side, then an anti clockwise turn on the top and bottom, followed by a half turn on the front face. When you're doing the algorithm, you can actually swap these positions, uh, these maneuvers and these maneuvers because they don't sort of affect each other. Um, I'll just show you that now. So, oops. This is the right hand turn that goes all the way around. Then you sort of put these back, so to speak, and turn it round. And then as you see, this piece and this piece have been swapped. <laughs> That's all for this episode. I uh, hope you've enjoyed it and you find it useful. As always, please leave me some uh, comments and likes on wherever the buttons appear on YouTube. And I'll be back soon with some more Beyond Beginners videos. Mm -hmm.